it has been an awesome year one. Um, we're up here in the mountains right now, actually closing up the last couple episodes of year one. Um, overall, we had a, a fun year. Uh, we learned a lot. We went on a bunch of hunts, uh, a couple different things. We did elk, we did some deer, we looked for some bears, we're turkey hunting right now. So it's been fantastic. So April 20th, which was a couple days ago, the 2022 New Mexico draw results just got released. And in this video, we're gonna be going over every hunt that we're going on this year, what we drew, and what you guys can expect from us this upcoming season. So Cody, do you wanna start them off? Yeah, so I'm gonna start out with September. I'm gonna have my elk hunt, the first through the 15th. And right after that, for like nine days or so, I gotta go on my deer hunt in another unit. So it'll be interesting to go do that. What do you think the difficulty between the elk and deer being kind of same same uh, time of year, obviously it's in the September, same as your hunt for your elk. Um, I think the elk hunt will be okay. Getting to that deer hunt's gonna be tough. It's so gonna be tough to prioritize the elk and yeah, then elk hey, if we need to move the deer, we'll move mm -hmm. the deer. That's a good idea, I like that. Cody is in pursuit of punching his first elk tag. So um, we're hoping we can help yeah, him get that done this year. It's gonna be a great time. That's mm -hmm. an exciting uh, achievement and priority. I'm going after mine, but not this year. <laughs> <laughs> So after Cody's hunt, we're going to have a little break for a little bit. And then come November, we're going to have an Oryx hunt. I'm in possession of my third overall Oryx tag. Been very lucky to draw those tags. Been success successful the other two times. And I'm hoping I can repeat it this time. So I'm going to look for a nice Oryx. And then in January, I have a archery mule deer hunt in a unit that I'm very familiar with. Um, in the past, I've harvested three mule deer there before, a really nice one. And this year I'm gonna be looking to break that record myself. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and, and the goals for that, I mean, it's a closer unit to where we live. So we'll have scouting opportunities. We'll have hopefully some content coming oh, out. Oh yeah, yeah, and that, that was the plan. You know, yeah. it's it's hard to travel across the state to do hunting. Yeah, And we're trying to explore as many un new units as we and can, but we might as well stay yeah. closer to home where we're familiar, um, you know, with elk, yeah. we don't really care. And we were we chasing go. mountain mule deer last year. And you know what, I think we all decided that, hey, let's go after some desert well, this year. It's fun to hunt in your backyard. Yeah. No, yeah. It's a good time. And did you say that your your deer hunt was a fourth choice? Did you tell them that? Oh yeah, was, that was, was a lucky. fourth choice. That was, <laughs> lucky. that was super lucky. Yeah, so but he kind of just got spit that. Glad uh, to have so, a tag. So this 2022 season, obviously it rolls into 2023 a little bit, but so 2023, that's January 2023, yeah. I have a mule deer hunt, uh, western side of the state, new unit to me, unit to all of us, Gavin's worked out there a little bit, um, and you know what, we're excited for that hunt, and then, hey, we're going to hit the Rockies, rocky slopes, we're going after some <laughs> Barbary tags this year, I got a, a January 1st to 15th hunt as well, overlapping the deer so i will split my time and i will go after both of them for sure both with the bow the thing about nick though is he already got a barbary sheep a couple of years yeah, ago yeah a couple so years back he's looking yeah. to fill his first mule yeah. deer tag. and that, that was a nice barbary i think it measured out 24 and a half on one side and so it wasn't your monster barbary but you know what what was that was with nice. the rifle yeah yeah i shot it with the 300 mag so. this time archery it's archery. <laughs> <laughs> i'm getting some sheep feet i'm getting something and i'm gonna go after it a lot this year yeah, once we get done with that really exciting first two weeks of January, January 20th, I'll be going on my first ever Barbary sheep hunt in the same place where Nick has previously yeah. been. Yeah. So he's going to be doing some scouting for me. Yeah. I'm going to go on my hunt <laughs> and then I'm going to be doing some scouting for <laughs> yeah. Cody, who is yep. going to be hunting in the right same place. Yeah. So, it, I mean, it's a wild year. We got a lot of tags we need to fill. We got three Barbary tags. And the best thing it's about it crazy. is we'll be in January. I'll be out there and I'm going to start naming these sheep. And then I'll go tell them which ones <laughs> yeah. they are. So, hey, that's Joe. Yeah. <laughs> go after Joe and Gavin, go after Frank and we'll be okay. So, and then uh, uh, we're not really going to go into detail on this in this episode. But uh, we do have a lot of tags with our friends and family that are really friends close to us that we're going to try to go on. Uh, not 100% sure if we're going to get that on video for you guys, but we'll definitely be trying to get some content on that as well. If anything, we'll get photography. Uh, we want to enjoy our time with our family and friends, and uh, any opportunity that Hill Monster Outdoors gets, we're going to try to go after. So on top of fly fishing. So yep. we'll have some more of that coming out this year. And Gavin, if you want to end this video and give them a good little... Thank yeah, you no. support. Oh, it's it's been awesome, guys. And, you know, we have a couple more videos that we have before we close out year one. We have some fishing videos coming up. And then this turkey video that we're on right now is going to be dropping 
that will be the end cap for year one. Mm -hmm. um, it's been great. You guys have been really supportive. I think right now we're almost at 10,000 views with yeah. two videos and an intro video. Um, you guys have given us the love on Instagram. We really appreciate yeah. it. Um, so we, we'd like to thank you for everything. And um, if you haven't yet, please like, leave a subscribe. Um, be sure to turn on notifications because we're going to be dropping a lot of content for you guys this year. So we're excited and stay tuned. Thank you.